Welcome back to Our World with Black Enterprise. Black Enterprise annual report reveals the lack of minorities on corporate boards. We take a look inside with a director who has a unique perspective. Paul Carrick Brunson has more. Bruce Gordon serves on three corporate boards, CBS, Northrop, Grumman, and ADT. As a member of the Black Enterprise Registry of Corporate Directors, he's also one of a small group of people directly impacting corporations that affect everyday Americans. You know, the average person, in my opinion, doesn't even recognize that, that corporate boards exist. Or if they've heard about boards, they don't fully understand what boards do. Boards set policy for corporations. So if you believe that corporate America is one of the major sources of power and influence in this country, I believe that. The average person may not know what happens inside the boardroom. What they simply need to recognize is that when we, people of color, have a seat at that table, it provides us the opportunity to influence policy, to affect issues around hiring, developing, retaining, and promoting. It puts us at the table where we can decide who gets to be the next chief executive officer. It is a powerful institution, the corporate board, and if properly managed, and pardon use of the word, manipulated, it puts people of color in a position to open doors that have been closed for decades to black folks. Gordon has seen an increase in the number of black directors, but admits more needs to be done. After all, minority directors often ensure that funds go to areas where it's needed. When you get into having conversations about budget, you get into having conversations about spending. When you talk about spending, you talk about with whom are you spending. It provides me, as a black director, the opportunity to raise the question, for the, of the billions of dollars that said institution, said corporation, is going to spend in a plan year, how much of that spend is gonna be with minority-owned companies? Gordon is a powerful addition to any board, having served as a top executive at Verizon and as CEO of the NAACP. To this former BE Executive of the Year, the key to attaining a seat on the board of a major corporation is a matter of performance. It's hard work and hard work and hard work. I've always believed, and I'm confident that this is the case, that you have to outwork everybody who's around you. You have to pursue excellence. It's not a matter of being as good as your peers, it's being better than your peers. It's being the best person in the organization at the job that you do. After the break, we examine a unique way to help educate children by basic social services to their parents.